Hello, my lovely YouTubers. Welcome to the channel of the Loquacious One. I am the Loquacious One, the one hit of quitters of affordable hauls. Thank you for tuning in. All my little sugar plum fairies and gumdrops. Thank you to my uh, rider dyers and my new subscribers. And I hope you will become one by clicking the subscribe button, thumbs up this video if you enjoy, tapping that notification bell as well as sharing if you're on social media. I do this for a hobby and not a living so i just enjoy sharing a little bit like you enjoy sharing with me so what is the haul about today anyone who knows me i have been doing dollar tree for the stationery it was fun it was whimsical it's inexpensive and i just had a blast i even found name brands of um stationaries so let me go through really quickly some of the things I found that may or may not be in your store and perhaps coming soon. So you have to be on it when they put it out because it goes really fast. From Jot, I got this wooden uh, stamp and it's uh, made like a cupcake because I love cake, cupcakes and that is cupcake dye on my hand. I, I ate the frosting. What is this blue that I ate? But the cupcakes are just simply marvelous. And I also, by Jot, I got this pencil sharpener that is made like a cupcake. I found this right here. This is a mock crock 13 pocket coupon file. And it's by Unison. So it's a name brand. And it's black. And it's kind of chic, chic looking. Ooh, ooh. You could put this easily in your purse or your uh, attache case for organizing. And I also throwing this in here. I found it was too cute, but I love pi pineapples. And this says, you are the pineapple of my eye. And I thought that was so awesome. How could you resist it? Okay. And let me just go over here and work my way around. This is a journal. It says Gypsy Spirit with their feathers. You know, I like feathers. And this is by Dollar Tree, 80 sheets. And I don't know if it's lined or not because I haven't opened it. But generally, they have been good about uh, having lined paper in their journals. I also found that this is by Crown Jewels. I bought two of these. It's sticky notes. That is lined awesome with pineapples. There are several different designs, but I got the pineapple because I love pineapples. I also found this to-do list pad, and it is the colors that I'm going with, the aqua blues and teals and Caribbean blues. Um, so I just got it because one, is lined, and two, I like the color. I found this little jot notebook and pen. It's 80 sheets. And this is really cute, the pen and the little notebook. If you notice, I got the uh, scarf that had this pattern. I did an accessory haul. And I'm going to throw this in the bag that I carry with that, simply because it matched. But they are cute. They have several uh, fun designs. They're, gra they're, they're just um, great to put in your bag. And, you know, you want to look somewhat like you spent money on your accessories. We could just put a plain notebook in there, but why do that? When for a little bit of money, you can just look so put together. And this is awesome. This is by Crown Jewels. Also, Crown, I mean, Dollar Tree, I mean, when they get it, they get it. And they do get it. And they trend very well. And a dollar, you cannot beat Dollar Tree. You just have to stay consistent in, find, in finding great deals. But I can name a ton of great things I found stationary-wise dish wise um nails i mean wrapping a gift cards dollar tree has been hitting it but this is a journal it has 50 sheets and it has a gold foil pineapple on it i don't know my li lighting is kind of lousy but you can see the awesomeness of that and i also found one in this pretty green with a gold foil cactus now coming on down the line they had labels out, so I always keep Dollar Tree labels because you can't beat them for the price. Awesome deal, but whenever I get some new ones that I think I can use, I grab them. And they give you a generous amount, I feel. This is a 60-count pack of giant paper labels, and they have two shapes, basically, 
in a multitude of colors. I see one, two, three, four, five colors, and it might be six, but I think it's five. Yeah. But it may be six. But look at the colors. I think they're just so great. And also by Jot Paper Labels, another 60 count pack. Look at the variety of shapes. These are just so good for labeling jars and what have you. These are my favorite. I use these when I'm um, labeling my uh, containers that I have organized for storage. And this is the 30 count, but they're much larger. As well as, again, my pretty teal. And you can see where I'm going with that. Labels, this is 30 count and it's larger, but really good for labeling your containers and organizers and what have you. These remind me of file folder uh, labels. It's a 60 count and it's in this pretty lime green color. And last but not least, I got the repacks of this. It's by Jot, but look at the labels, gold foil trim. This is an awesome deal. It looks so luxe for less. And I got the repacks. Okay, and that's it. That's all for my stationery haul. I have several stationery hauls that I put out. I'm going to try to, and I keep saying this, put all my um, hauls together that are similar. But again, you know, that I have to do. That's a to-do. Because I've been really lazy about doing that, folks. All right. If you enjoyed this video, please click the subscribe button. Tap the notification bell. Thumbs up it. Let me know you enjoyed the contest. And please share if you're on social media. If you have any links you want me to review or subscribe to, please leave that also in the box below. And as always, if you have any criticism, be constructive. And a lot of times when people thumbs down, not that thumbs down really bother most YouTubers, I believe, because people have been really great. They either just looked at it and went on past or they thumbs it up. But I'm just saying overall concern to everyone we're on here. It is just something we're sharing. We just, and that's human nature. So rather than, I, I've been seeing people thumbs down other YouTubers. If you don't like it, just you know, go to the next one. Why do you sit up there and look at something you don't like and then thumbs it down? Everything isn't for everybody. If you don't like it, pass it by. If you really like it and you learn something, give them a thumbs up. It's just, it's just adequate, folks. And it's just being a decent human being. All right. Till next time, this is Loquacious One. Love you all. Bye-bye.